I would like her to delve a little. You know, these are our young ladies. Now, everybody says you need to work hard because hard work pays off. You know, and they tell you, no, you don't need to work uh -huh. hard. You need to work smart, smart. right? right. Uh -huh. Okay. Now, so what does smart mean when you say work smart versus work hard? Okay. So I think for me, and maybe they can also help me too, because we're learning from each other. And this is how I think life is. It isn't that just because I traversed a certain path, I know it all. Yes. But in my view, working hard means that a lot of times you might face a lot of challenges along the way. Whether mm -hmm. or not you're even doing it smartly, mm -hmm. not every day is going to be a good day. Mm -hmm. But you're not going to give up mm -hmm. along the journey. And the that, key thing me, is not to give up along the journey. Up. It's going to be tough sometimes. You're going to be disheartened. You're not, sometimes even going to wonder whether this is really where I want to be. Mm -hmm. But tomorrow will come. And with tomorrow comes a new day and a new opportunity to prove yourself again and to give it your very best. So, For me, that's working hard. Okay, that's working hard, hard yes. versus working smart. Well, I think we've taken working smart in a slightly, or given it a negative connotation. Which is? In that it means I want to cut corners. Is that yes. what it means to you? Yes. You want to cut corners. Okay. Now, to me, that's not working smart. Mm -hmm. Because if I cut a corner, and the corner I'm cutting may mean that I have actually changed fundamentally or brought in something that shouldn't be there, I may not have done the right thing. And that's where the integrity comes. We could do it smart in that perhaps it takes too long. Yes. You understand me? Yes. yes. So that I agree. There are lots of things that it takes too long. Um, we do that in, even in science, and we mm. do it in what we call lean. Mm. You look at the entire process. Mm -hmm. There are certain steps that add value to it, and some we say do not add value. Okay. But first, I have to differentiate. Mm -hmm. Which ones are not adding value, so that if I remove them, then am I still having the same end result? Mm -hmm. Okay? Mm -hmm. So it could be that, fine. Um, uh, you want to get from point A to point B, mm -hmm. but I need to traverse this corner, that corner, there, mm -hmm. okay? However, maybe if I go this direction, that's smart, right? Yes. I've gotten there, yes. yes. But if you had told me I needed to pick up certain things along the journey, by cutting it this way, I've, I've left them out. Okay. I may not then end up with the desired result. So when you take those ones out, if you were working smart, mm. you have to check whether the end result yeah. is what you actually wanted. You know, it, Theresa, some say that working smart also means that I know my purpose, mm -hmm. I know the destination mm -hmm. I want to go to, mm -hmm. and therefore I don't need to waste time doing other things that do not add value okay. to my destination. Okay. So now the point is, because I hear a lot of young people say, you know, Auntie Jane, I don't know what my purpose is in life. How do I identify what my purpose is? How do I identify where my talent is? Uh, how do I identify where to add value? Where do you say to, what do you say to these young ladies? How do I identify my purpose? There, what makes me tick? But therein lies the conundrum. Mm -hmm. In that, if you are rushing to get to the end, you didn't actually enjoy the journey. Yeah. You didn't get all the experiences that might help you to then identify that purpose, okay. to then perhaps learn a few things. And believe you me, all of us know things that even if you think back from whether school or even today, Maybe, why was I learning this subject? What yes. am I going to do with it? That's what I keep Like hearing. the literature. Oh, I read literature. I also I'm read a, literature. I'm, a, I'm the Julius Caesar, the engineer, But I read it. That's fantastic. Do you understand? Because I loved it. It doesn't okay. mean that, but later, perhaps when I'm writing a report, what I've learned in literature in terms of language I can apply. Okay. So when I was doing it, it wasn't for that purpose. Mm -hmm. In life, if you're always looking for just getting to the end result, mm -hmm. you miss the view. You don't take in a few other experiences. And, and that's where sometimes we're always rushing. 